Welcome everybody, Sword of the Grin Brothers here, and we're continuing our playthrough of Monster Hunter Stories 2, Wings of Ruin, or as it eternally turns out, Wings of Sugar. Hello. Because the rivers and sky turned to chocolate. Uh, maybe this episode will go a bit smoother and be slightly less know, awkward. This be dangerous. But... And this kid only just became a real rider. And I'm pretty sure she's not even from around here. <laughs> now you're Look, her skin's never touched the sun. It's alright, you're just a shutting. You look a bit jaundiced, but... Her hair is green! What have you been eating? Aren't you? Yes, he, um... Uh, do all the Rafa horses have the name Rafa? Yes. I can't I can't tell them apart at this point! How do you know which Rafa? Just get a team of Raflos and all call them Rafa. Your grandfather, Red, was a fine, upstanding rider. Now, then, why, then why am I not named Green? Or Orange? <laughs> well, ironically, he's going to have green hair. Grandfather, red. Dot, 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 dot. His young version will, and anyway. Sadly, he does talk. The island alongside well, they made ra red talk in Pokemon Masters, and I think that was a big uh, disappointment. Yeah. What is with people against being against mute characters? It's because it's, like, I guess more difficult sure to write for. People now. are just not... I think that's fascinating to have an actual mute character. You think Game Freak can write Liam? No, like I can play like you know, like a lot of series will suddenly say, "Oh, now they can talk." They're just like, like Golden Sun, for instance. Isaac was mute throughout the entire first game. The moment you're playing as another character in Golden Sun Two, Isaac can suddenly talk. Yeah, it's like that just makes everything really awkward. <laughs> He's just rude. <laughs> um, yeah, Castlevania. I'll talk about it properly. Uh, we Super basically binged all sure four this? seasons. It's a big job to dump on a rookie's um, me and my partner. Well, you had a break between season uh, season two and three. Because I remember you finishing off season two, and then it was like a week till you finished off. No, we started watching it. Okay. It just took us a little bit longer, because uh, I think I'd together. had my jab and stuff like that. So I wasn't feeling great. Okay, I can guide you. Because, like, the first Use two the days of having the jab, you're a bit... Well, oh, I'm thankful for a guide, given, you know, what happened in Monster Hunter World 2, a world uh, where I couldn't find the mushrooms. Mean, I'm here to guide you. So, I'll be a teacher? Yeah. Mm, just hat, dressed up like that. Something wrong? <laughs> <laughs> Not, like, set on a rider or anything. Hat literally wearing, like, the battle bikini and shorts. <laughs> I'm impressed they gave the shorts. They they sometimes don't even do that. It was probably a censorship thing. Mm. You, Japan probably wanted to omit them, but they were like, we couldn't do that overseas and we can't be bothered to make two character models. Um, don't worry, I'm sure someone will mod it soon anyway. Um, overall, this will be spoilers for Castlevania. Overall, I really like Castlevania. Oh, I was a little concerned that there was going to be Battle Bikini as well. No. Um, I enjoyed it a lot. I have one larger gripe and then one small gripe as like the main things that come to mind, which are both in Season 4. All the stuff I've watched is from like YouTube clips. So like... That's not bad. If... Also, spoiler warning. Yeah, I already said that. Oh, you said it last episode. I didn't know if you said it this I episode. I literally said it, like, okay. um, five seconds ago. An ominous chocolate light flashes on the night of the festival. Um, Protect of the island, Rafa. Guardian Rafi. <laughs> See, oh, no. that's a different name. No, there's a Raffian later called Rafi. Oh, wow. Oh, disappeared. What could be the cause of these strange events? Um, Chief Gotara orders the riders of the village to look into it. So you take your very the first step surrender. I didn't, I didn't need to read that. I treated you like Americans. Is it like in the Metro Dread trailer where everything had to be narrated? Is it Kazakage? Is that what Gara <laughs> is? Gara is the Kazakage, yeah, yes. Glad we've got him on our side, because I wouldn't want to be against him. Um, so my only real gripes is the minor gripe is one of the characters dying when it didn't really seem necessary was but it's a minor gripe because it's like I can see why they did it I just would have liked for it to not happen which is Lenore 
Was he the one who was... Nora's a girl. Oh. Uh, she's one of the vampire sisters. She ended up falling... Her and Hector ended up having a relationship. And I just wanted Hector to be happy, man. But like, wasn't the one who like forced into making an army? Yeah, he was basically enslaved. blackmailed yeah. and enslaved. But like him and Lenore got along, and like had a thing going, and like I wanted them to be happy together. But she was basically like, my sister's dead, and I'm basically imprisoned in my own castle. I don't really want to live like this, so I'm just gonna walk out in the sun and die. And so she did, and it was like. A, very cute moment and sad and stuff. Very cute moment. Ah! <laughs> she died very peacefully. Everyone else was having violent deaths. And she just kind of like... The fish have died from chocolate. Because, um... Drowning in the chocolate. <laughs> Take a look at my water! Um... It was... Early on he had made a comment to her about how he misses, like... The sunrise and like, like daytime is just as beautiful as the night. So she went out. She turned. Oh, to him. apparently I can't buy water because I'm not a full-fledged rider. Yeah. I'm to die of dehydration. You got to drink the ocean. There's a whole ocean there. Yeah, you'll you'll need to talk to. The, you'll need to do the tutorial to get access to the stuff. Mumble mumble. I hate it here! <laughs> yeah. I'm saying, that's the, like, really angry guy. Yeah. Um. But yeah, so... She basically, like, turned to him and was like, Oh, you are a silly boy, Hector. Is this all there is to it? As she, like, slowly turned to dust. Meanwhile, the other vampire deaths, like, that had happened recently were all, like, violently burning, screaming in agony as they, like, shrivel into bone. Or my favourite, uh, Camilla's death, where she decides that she won't let Isaac kill her and instead kills herself, and explodes. <laughs> like, she stabs herself with a sword, and half the castle explodes? <laughs> and it's like, what? It's like being hit by a kunai in Naruto. And like the two, oh no, the two lesbian vampires were on their way back. They see the massive explosion and they like like go forward a bit. They look to each other and go, Did you feel that? <laughs> it's like, feel it? You should have seen it! <laughs> so how is Isaac, aka the guy who in Castlevania 3 was basically Voldo? Hi there. Isaac, um... It's Why weird. You talk to everyone. No, you don't. Just go talk to Kanya. They don't. You'll know if they're gonna give you something because they'll have an icon. Oh, above I didn't know their if head. there was any side quests or like no, extra not loot yet. to you'll find. Go, do that. Liam, go talk to Kanya. It'll literally give you the tutorial and side oh, quests. What, what happened? You ended. Oh, your I house. have my house. Yeah, you've got a house. Looking good. You gotta live somewhere. Change your appearance, clean the colour of your armour at the chest in your house. Like... So can I like, change the colour of the clothes already? Yeah, armour colour already. Awesome. Yeah. And you don't get layered armour for ages. It doesn't matter because the colours don't carry over to the other sets of armour. You have to do them all individually. Which is a bit annoying. So what I'm saying is you're going to replace this in, well, at this rate, in 20 years. Why is Vanilla back already? Hmm, there's no armor. Okay. No, because you don't have like just... No, no, I was just... <laughs> Please! <laughs> <laughs> but they're going to start talking, and I didn't want to completely uh, interrupt you. Yeah. No, it's just like text boxes, it's fine. Okay. If they have like actual words, I'll just talk over them, because screw them. <laughs> Um, besides, I can talk about Castlevania Bananas. for, like, a fair while. Okay, I also want to try my squash tea at some point, um, but... But, uh, yeah, I Took you long enough. would have preferred... Don't say she agrees to you. Hey, you need to lighten up, newbie. Angie face. <laughs> They're you. Not 
Hobnob has yet to Blackbeard from what I've seen, so... It, I still find it funny when my character did the angry face and it was just like, you're not intimidating. Or you fucking yellow highlight hair. Yeah, and like the fuck bloody love heart eyes as well. She's got the heart pupils. Mm. Yeah, people keep drawing Nanka with like love heart eyes as well, but it's like I literally had as part of a thing that Nanka doesn't like, you know, generic, nearly romance themed sort of things, like, you know, love heart items sort of things. Yeah. Ranma! That's good, because I definitely need all the people guiding me possible. Yes. It's funnier, because you get another character who's literally just like... They're the person that does the talking for you, and guides you. And then you technically get another character that guides you. <laughs> they really don't trust you to go up on your own. Like, everyone's hand on He's like, no, I want to explore. No, we've and seen like, you. Everyone's... Your character's actually... Stop, a stop talking to the NPC! Your character's actually a Ryoga type. I... <laughs> Wait, the um, the park you declared the fight was uh, um, was just like a short distance from your house, right? It was a straight road, right? Yeah, what about it? Why did it take you three weeks to get there? <laughs> I had a, uh, I got lost, okay? All right. It was five minutes! Manual is also very helpful. Um, you make it sound like it's like the map from Dora the Explorer. Maybe it is. If you take enough meds, anything can talk to you. Um, yeah. Then my uh, bigger gripe with Castlevania. Yeah, again, this primarily affects Season 4. Uh, in Season 3, there was a character called Saint Germain. Oh, is um, he the one who does the resurrection thing? Yes. At the very end, yeah. I, I saw like a clip of um, him and people said, it's really sad how he... He bigs himself up at first in a lot of the flashback, and that by the end, when looking for a job, he's like, "I am whatever you need." Yes. All for his pursuit to resurrect his loved one. Uh, no, that was before he met his loved one. Oh. Um. So, Saint Germain's whole thing was that he had lost his loved one in the infinite corridor. Which is this really trippy place that is basically a connection to different universes and like dimensions. But prayer pot? Yes. You give it charms and it will give you buffs. Okay. Um, or you can just pray to Don't it to get a buff. I'm assuming I've got nothing, so I'm a longsword user from the get go? Uh, great sword. Great sword. Longsword isn't in this game. You have great sword. Is No. Aww. You have greatsword. This is funny. I was wanting to have like two pets. You have slash weapons, pierced weapons, and blunt weapons. Divided in them, you've got greatsword and sword and shield for slash. Which saying, my own is that's hydro and cutscenes then. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you've got gun lance and bow for pierce, and you've got hammer and hunting horn for blunt. Mm, where's Ryder's notes? Go across. Oh, okay. That's a lot. There's a lot of things to keep a track of. Oh gosh! Those are your abilities. I don't know how to use a great sword, so. Um. I'm assuming this is. A, I'll get a tutorial fight. Yeah. Okay. I don't need You're in the tutorial. Okay. This is like part of the demo, so. Acquire an egg. Yeah. <laughs> What's that kid doing talking to the banana? It's a royal loo drop. They were a spongy baby. Oh, a monster expert. Can you imagine if it was instead called Monster Hunter? Monster Hunter. It's just. Ooh, ooh Monster Hunter! And, and Capcom managed to make millions off their latest game. No, I don't believe that they managed to get a mainstream audience interested in Monster Hunter World D. <laughs> I mean, if they really wanted to make a lot of money, they'd just uh, be like, yeah, we, we turned them all into like. Pretty girls and buff boy monsters, because you people are weird. Um, but yeah. <laughs> might as well take advantage of it. I might not even do it. Oh great, I'm back in the Lola. Yeah, I'm gonna hate this. Yeah, good luck. Everyone's too happy. Uh, you can't have them as pets. But oh. Uh, yeah, that was my. Reaction. But they're the cooler ones. That was my reaction as well. <laughs> um. 
generally, if you think you're gonna like, I have a feeling that a lot of the ones that you would like can't go as pets. Okay, so because it's gonna get told, I'm just gonna yeah. quickly try out my Scottish breakfast tea that you bought me. You and Eliza bought me a while back. Oh yeah. So, uh, this is Scottish English breakfast. A slight multi taste, which grows stronger. Okay, that definitely grows stronger. A did slight multi taste, but otherwise okay. it's just kind of English breakfast. I was to say, did you say multi or moldy? Multi. Okay. Um, it's a taste I a set, a sign equivalent to licking a ceramic tile. Which doesn't sound like I'm calling it a good thing, but it's a decent enough taste. Just very weird. You get very hungry when at work. I didn't listen to anything you said, but yes. Um, well, that'll be fun, you listening back to it in recording. So yeah, uh, just to make a note later after I finish recording this, basically English breakfast, but of a multi-flavour that grow is a bit weaker first, but grows stronger. But I did leave it a while, so it's a bit cold and a bit milky, so maybe I'll try it again another time when it's warmer. Okay. Um, yeah, St. Germain. Um... His whole shtick is that he was an alchemist and scholar and magician and such. And uh, he wanted to traverse the infinite corridor so he could find his wife. I have no idea why people are, like having the tea leaves loose. No. Nah, it's like, horrible. Apparently you're supposed to like, you can like swallow these, but honestly it doesn't feel good. No. By the way, you can't explore properly. In this cut, this that's good tutorial. because that'll mean I'll go quicker. Just go straight to the thing because if you try running the other ways, they're like, No, and like grab you and rain you back. Well, oh, oh, I slipped through her, yeah. So I could at least talk to her on the monster. No, so do I can jump or, yeah, oh, yeah, Whee! not all monsters can jump. Jump is an ability, okay. So there's no items to pick up, no loot to look for. Technically, there is, but if you try walking too far away, they'll be like, No. Okay, so I've got to be up a monster. Uh, yeah. Kill these innocent oh. herbivores. Yeah, you can jump over them. Okay. Oh, I was about to say, which part of him is real? <laughs> uh, They're all illusions! Oh, yeah, that is an impractically sized weapon. Yeah, it's a great sword. Like, what do where you does, like that, that even looks bigger than, like, if Nanka sheathed that sort of thing, she'd just, it'd be dragging across the ground. She wouldn't actually be able to walk anywhere. Yeah. The hunters are basically Spartan soldiers. No, but as in, like, you know, how does she put it away? Because it's bigger than her, it. so she's just kind of like, you know, dang her legs up in there, sort of. No, because it wouldn't be directly down. You angle it. Yeah, but then you're punching it back all the time. No, you it's wouldn't. an Aptonoff. He's making He's going to the me. side. Okay, let's see what you and your Ramna can do. Select fight and use power. Well, you know what Ramna can do, because. You... Also, it's kind of stupid they're asking you to do a power attack because it's a power monster, so you're going to draw instead of winning. When you're opponent are targeting each other... I can probably explain this easier than she can. You enter head-to-head. For the free attack times power beats technical, technical beats speed, and speed beats power. Try to remember that. So she You'll is... remind me. Yeah. Those are the three, so red beats green, you green say, beats blue. I constantly get them mixed These up. These are the three types of power, power, speed, and technical. Each of them have a, a strength and weakness, affecting all the So smart people get beaten up by bully, uh, big, strong, burly people, and fast people peg it. Um, yeah. Attacking an opponent that is targeting you, sugar. Who's that? Bad <laughs> shade, line shade, target. Yeah. Yeah, it's just really funny so, that, um, you know, <clears throat> Uh, Russia has banned Izakai's when there is literally an Izakai about, you know, an their leader. About everyone. Um, yeah, so if you lose a head to head, you take double damage. If you win a head to head, you take and if you half draw, you damage. both take damage. Yeah, well, you both take damage anyway. Yeah. So even if you lose the head to head, you still do damage to the enemy. Even if you win, you <clears> still <throat> lose. Good. Yeah. So that line just tells you who it's attacking, kind of. Um,. So I can okay, if, so I go with speed, technical speed. Oh, speed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's it wrong. Yes, I know you have just told me what to do, but what if? Um, that yeah. wasn't very fast at all. No. In fact, I stopped moving to swing, so... But you did it. Really, the monster was just too nice. They're also like peaceful herbivores. 
So, you know. It boost your kinship. Yeah. Okay. So double attack. <laughs> ah, we're melding together. Oh god. If you and your monster, or uh, they, they, they actually—I thought it was just the child calling it a monster, not no, they that's actually. No, the official term. Oh gosh. Uh, or um. It was in a double attack. So if. Yeah. So if you and your monster are attacking the same thing and both using speed attacks, mm. and it's going to head to head with you or your monster, you initiate a double attack. Yeah. If. So is he going to use a speed? Yeah, he's going to use a speed because it's safe. Yeah. So does it always predate what his attack's going to be? Yes. Uh, it will also tell you what your allies' attacks are going to be. So you can do that with them as well. Yeah. So you can double attack with your partner's monster, and they can double attack with your monster, but you can't double attack with the rider human. Oh, that's a bit of a shame. You can double attack with the hunted humans, but... They don't have spoiler. They don't have monsters. Like one of your allies is a hunter. Yeah, I expected that. But they don't have a monster. He you? can't double attack with your monster. Yeah, that's a nice balance. Um. So we I, riders respect the monsters. We just killed an herbivore for no reason. We respect the monsters. No, there is a reason. We're killing it and stealing its unborn children. But that's what the hunters kind of do. No, they skin them. They eat the unborn children. We indoctrinate, indoctrinate them. Yeah, that, indoctrinate. Doesn't sound like a word. Indoctrinate. Yeah. Um. But we're the good guys. Like I thought, the point was like we're pacifists to monsters and didn't kill them. But no, well, technically you don't actually kill them. We did. We got his tail and raw meat. Yeah. We must have killed him. Except you still get that if they like flee. But that makes no sense. And when they flee, like. Like he wouldn't have me over it. It's a herbivore. Liam, you don't understand how Monster Hunter works. Clearly, um, that monster is completely fine. I guarantee you, it <laughs> got up and just walked away. Um, yeah. Oh, it's like twenty-two minutes in. You said you were going to want to talk about it across the episode. Yeah. So. I'll finish talking about Saint Germain next episode because it did upset me a bit. Okay, they want me to have a herb, which has a H in it. Herb. So it's herb, not herb. Time to eat some herbs. <laughs> Much like that poor herbivore we just killed. Herbivore. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Herbivore? I barely knew her. <laughs> oh, they're not criticizing me for going off the path. No, not anymore. Oh, okay. But they will want you. Well, I collect that. They might do, actually. I don't know. Okay. Go collect the egg. Okay, yes. Go I will. steal chip. Well, actually, that's end the episode. Yeah, then so you can steal chip. And I was doing this whilst we were ending the so, episode. So, um, like, you were going to complete opposite. I know, but we might as well do this whilst we're ending uh, the episode and then start with me getting the egg. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, there, there you go. go. Like, comment, subscribe, and watch our content to um, hear me talk about Castlevania spoilers and, and indoctrinate children. Still, steal the unborn children. Cheerio! Bye.